going on everyone? It's your boy Stu back here with week six of the baseball draft league. So this week we're up against our friend Nick here. Um, new coach into the baseball league. Um, picked up I believe for coach Lalo, Lalo, whatever it was. So I believe this will be his uh, second matchup in the baseball league. So this is the uh, team that he's going to be rocking with here. Go through it real quick. Um, up first, Annihilate. Um, definitely going to be a problem with Defiant with me having um, Intimidate on Landorus. Going to have to watch out for that, but uh, this thing is just super bulky. Hits pretty hard, gets Rage Fist, so this might be a problem. Goldango. Um, I know this guy is probably going to go Scarf Dango because that's what he loves to do with Berserker. Um, but he might surprise me and go like Specs or something like that. So if he does that, cool. Works out in our favor. Next, Berserker. Um, this thing is just good because of Steely Spirit. Um, does get some fake out pressure, which may be annoying, but uh, yeah, not really too worried about this guy. We have some ways to deal with him, so not super worried about it. NDD, um, we made a trade, him and I, so I ended up getting um, Iron Hands and Bruxish, trading him NDD and Berserker which is why he's got both of those on his team now. Um, so we, we already know what this does. It's going to Psychic Surge. It's going to set up uh, Psychic Seed, Follow Me, Trick Room, you know, blocks for priority moves, which is something that I don't think I added on any except for maybe a Fake Out on Iron Hands, which, you know, will be all right there. Uh, Corviknight, another Mon that he took off my team that I dropped. But uh, Bulky Tailwind Setter mainly what I believe this thing is going to be doing. I don't see it doing much. Maybe Iron Head some stuff, but uh, yeah. Not really super worried about this. Maybe some Brave Birds might be kind of annoying or some uh, Iron Defense um, Body Press shenanigans, but we got ways to deal with this as well. Um, Urshifu, this thing could be kind of a problem if he does decide he wants to scarf this instead. Um, Again, got some ways to deal with it. We got Tailwind support. We got our own Scarf Mon that'll knock off Scarfs, which will be nice. So, yeah, this thing kind of a problem. It gets Sucker Punch, gets uh, whatever that move is, Wicked Blow, which goes right through Protects. So that's fun. Um, yeah. Uh, Gothitelle, I don't see this coming, but Shadow Tag could be annoying. Um, does have pretty good special, but it does have good bulk in general, really. Um, but I don't expect to see this. If we do, I mean, we got dark moves to deal with this, so not a huge deal there. Next is the Azumarill. Um, huge power, belly drum could be a thing. Huge power with life orb could be a thing. Um, but hopefully, again, I don't think we're going to see this. Unless he wants to match it up with, like, Colossal or something like that. Uh... Next is the Alolan Dugtrio. This, I have a feeling he could potentially scarf this because of how high his speed is, or he could potentially band it with how high his attack is, and then with it being super speedy already. So this could be a problem with some earthquakes with uh, um, Rock Slide, Sucker Punch, it gets Sucker Punch too. So definitely gonna have to watch out for that. And then last is the Colossal Steam Engine, always a problem. If he does want to, like, you know, do some shenanigans with Azumarill and, you know, Aqua Jet into Colossal for the Steam Engine booth with, like, weak po weakness policy or something like that. So he can, you know, run away with the game with that. But hopefully we won't allow him to set that up. So, switching over to my team here for what we're going to run this week. Um, going for a little bit of a different strategy. Um, so, first off, instead of Scarf Landorus, we're running Life Orb Landorus. Um, Stomping Tantrum, Terror Blast with Flying, Crunch, and Protect. Um, again, gotta watch with the Intimidates on the Annihilate for Defiant. But, uh, yeah. Gonna try to hit things hard. Um, we outspeed uh, Goldango without Scarf, which is nice. Um, so, Cyclozar is hopefully gonna be the guy to start knocking off wherever the Scarf is on his team. And, you know help do some shenanigans with that uh so scarf um cyclozar is outspeeding everything on his team that's not under tailwind 
So, you know, knock off Sunny Day in case we want to do some uh, strategies with Iron Hands. And we didn't have Earth, Earth Power or uh, Heat Wave on him, so. Sunny Day for Iron Hands. Um, Shed Tail, Protect, kind of a pretty basic setup here. Um, next, since we talked about it, Iron Hands, um, one of the mods I got from the trade. Assault Vest with uh, max HP as much as we can with a little bit of special defense investment. Um, this thing isn't dying to nothing. Um, Flying Terra in case he wants to bring some ground moves with that uh, Alolan Dug Trio. We can Terra Flying and kind of stay away from that. But rocking uh, Wild Charge for the uh, Corviknight. Drain Punch for any Steel Mons. Play Rough for uh, Urshifu and the uh, other thing. What's that thing? Annihilate. And then Fake Out. Just have that Fake Out pressure. Um, next is Bruxish. Bruxish here. Uh, was going to do like a Trick Room setup. But kind of just keeping it around with the Dazzling. Trick Room in case, you know, for whatever reason he knocks out Cyclozar early. And we need to just slow down the game into our favor. We can always do a uh, Trick Room maneuver here. And get that going. Um, maxing out both Special and Physical Defense as much as we can. Steel Terra. Probably should change this to like Dark Terra or something like that. Or Fairy Terra. No, not Fairy Terra. But Steel Terra. You know, the only thing really hitting this is Annihilate and, um, what's it called? Urshifu. So just have to play around that. And then we're bringing a Spather here. Um, got a, a set that I saw online for its stats, but nice bulk here. With a Terra Fairy, it's living anything from Urshifu or, um, um, Annihilate, and then we just, you know, set up Calm Mind, Blast of Dazzling Gleam, Baton Pass if we need to, into something else, and get those extra stat boost. And then, last but not least, High Dragon, um, running Terra Fairy this week to help deal with the Urshifu and to deal with the Annihilate, um, but Tailwind, just so we can match his Tailwind if he does bring Corviknight. Earth Power, Dark Pulse, Terra Blast with Terra Fairy Terra. So that'll be the team we're rocking with this week. Um, hoping to not take another L because we've been on like a, a big time losing streak and I'm getting sick of it. So definitely got to win this one this week. Um, yeah, let's switch it over to the battle. And here we are with the battle. Let's see what he wants to bring. Alright. Oh, I forgot about the Hall of Show. Okay. Hall Dango, um, Urshifu, Azumarill, um, Doug Trio. Okay. Um. Well, I definitely don't like that Halucha being a thing. So let's see. We see fake out pressure. Let's go. Cyclozar, Astathra. We don't see um, Annihilate, which is nice. Let's go here and here. Yep. Oh. Do that. Oh, it's probably a mistake, but it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. See what he wants to bring first. Hallu Chucker. Alright, so this is perfectly fine. Um we're gonna knock off and we're gonna Terra 
Do we just do it? Yeah, I like just going for it. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it! No switch. So as long as we live both of these, we should be good. Knock off. What do we see? Life orb. No scarf there. Okay, right, that's power herb. Fine. Wicked blow. We eat that. We eat that. Come on, double KO here. I know we're getting at least one. Let's go. Huge threat. Huge threat. Doug Trio. Are you Scarf too? You might have Sucker Punch. I think we're gonna protect here. Yeah. I like protecting here. See what he's gonna do. What did you have? You had a sash. I don't know what he clicked. We're just gonna knock off again. Get rid of that thing. Um, and then I like calm minding here because we should outspeed. That's fine. He's probably gonna get rid of Cyclozar here. Cool. So, Alucha takes out Psych. We get a nice Calm Mind boost. A boosty boost. We can go... Hands here. And he did not bring... Did not bring NDD. So... Let us... Do we predict the protect? Because he just protected with Doug Trio, so he could protect with Halucha here. We can just dazzle the game, can't we? If he protects, that's fine. Doug Trio should get knocked out here. Okay, they're both dead. See as Uberl. Didn't even bring the Goldango game one. What a guy. That's a lot.
still don't know what that move is that he clicked with, uh... Doug Trio. Alright. Good start. Up one game. That's what we like to see. What we like to see. So I think we just go in with the same lead. I think we just go in with the same team. Because he doesn't even know what my third mon or my fourth mon was. Let him make the adjustment. We might see the uh, Scarf Dango here. Which if we do that'll kind of suck, but it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Because we can always protect her. Zoomer or Okay. Okay. Um. What does that have? I don't know what that has. Or should I just ted shed tail? Maybe? Yeah, I kind of like just shed tail in here. Yeah, let's do that, and then... Um, we'll protect... Yes, ma'am. Tail. You can go. I drag him. Shit, if I protect and he wicked blows, I'm screwed. Okay, it just close combated. Okay. Thank God. I definitely fucked up that turn, but it worked out. Alright. So we outspeed both now. Um, yeah. I don't know what we would, why we wouldn't. Hopefully he doesn't sucker punch. Maybe he didn't bring sucker punch. I feel like I'm playing this game kind of bad. I mean, we should take out. Unless he has Dango Berserker in the back, which we still have knockoff for, so it's fine. Oh, that's a huge miss. 
that's that's huge. Here comes Django. <laughs> Hmm, Dango out here really sucks. Should we go into hands here? I feel like we should. And then we can protect this turn. If he predicts the play rough and gets me, then he gets me. Oh, he withdrew. Cool. So now we see Berserker. Very much. Okay. Um. So we fake out the dango, and we. I want a baton pass, and we'll go into high dragon here. Oh, you withdrew. Back in the general. Cool. And we go into a dragon. Why didn't I get? I didn't stop. Ah. Okay. I fucked up. I fucked up, I fucked up, I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up. Dream punch. And knock off whatever this thing has. Shuck a berry. Zerker. Um, let's do this, and, oh, I feel like I gotta do this. I hope it takes out a Zoomeral here. I feel like we should take out a Zoomeral without boost. We, we might die here, now that I think about it. I think this Dango is going to take me out. I think I dog goofed. I should have protected. Got the speed boost. Would have outspeeded Gold Dango. And then I could have taken them both out. Maybe. <laughs> Okay. Fucked up. 
God damn it. So we'll go Cyclazar, Spathra, Hands, Land. Yeah, that's fine. Choke it here. All right, Nick. We got. I wish I would have looked and seen what that move was. I don't know if it was Sucker Punch or if it was like Earthquake or something. Archip was in Alright. I like Shed Tail with. Terra Fairy Dazzling Gleam. Yeah. Alright, this should take out Urshifu. the Landorus here. Get a nice Intimidate drop on the Azumarill here. But we already know that's living. Why did that outspeed me? That should have outspeeded me. Doesn't matter. Double protect here. See what he wants to do. I feel like he's gonna bring in. Maybe I shouldn't. I feel like he's just gonna bring in uh, Berserker here. 
Let's let's protect. And then we should outspeed with uh I mean even though we don't do any damage. Here comes Terra Steel. I feel like we might have to let his pather go down here. Or we let somebody go down. Yeah. Let's do this and... We'll do this for some extra chip. Okay, it just fixed up. So. Alright, we live. Fuck! Switch in hand. Like that would have been the, the smarter play. Shit, at minus... Is that minus two or minus three? I think it's GG's. Oh. Not a hundred percent over yet. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Azumarill takes us out with a uh, play rough here. We need a play rough miss. Defense drop enough? It's not enough. We clutched it! Iron Hands takes out its old owner! What a fucking legend! Oh my god! 
Holy shit. What a game. Finally got one back. Should have held on to your boy Iron Hands, but he wanted that Berserker too damn bad. Whew! My heart's racing right now. Huge win there on the way to the playoffs. Thanks everybody for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed. Catch y'all next time. See ya.